Now at six, Lance won 400 grand, Rhonda won 50,000, and John won $175,000 in the Illinois lottery. They got their money, but future winners won't, at least for a while, all because of the state budget mess. Good evening, I'm Rob Johnson. Kate has the day off. There's a saying about the lottery, you can't win if you don't play. Well, now the lottery is saying we can't pay even if you've won until the governor and lawmakers agree on a budget in Illinois. And as Dorothy Tucker found, that has some lottery players wondering, why bother? Still printing tickets, still taking players' money, but for the big winners, nothing but an IOU. Due to the ongoing budget situation, some lottery winner payments have been delayed. People are playing the lottery, shouldn't have to worry about what the budget's about. This is something that we're trying to, you know, get rich. Hopefully. <laughs> Yet there was no warning at the lotto payout counter at the Thompson Center when we visited today. No sign, no message to players there won't be big payouts anytime soon. Winning tickets over 25,000 have quietly been on hold since the start of the new fiscal year, July 1st. The latest punishment inflicted on Illinoisans by an historic budget stalemate. So there's no sense in playing the lotto? That's a gamble the lotto can't afford. I think it's a big risk if they don't fix it right away. It's that lottery brand that's going to suffer because they're playing for fun. A $400,000 jackpot turned big dreams into broken ones for a retiree in Bourbonnet. I don't think it's fair. It was a happy day. Uh, my husband was really excited. I thought he was going to have a heart attack. Many small retailers rely on the lotto for the small purchases players make during their visits. I'll be out of work. And, and then that wouldn't be good. Someone at the state lottery should be out of a job, says market researcher Matthew Smith. Most lottery directors make sure that they're not impacted by that. Somebody kept their eye off the ball. Other states have run into this budget problem before, but never broke the promise to winners, you win, we pay. Governor Rauner, Speaker Madigan, the state comptroller, and even the attorney general today all told us basically the same thing. Until someone goes to court, there's nothing they can do. Rob? Yeah, another sidebar of the whole budget mess, to be